In this video clip we're going to talk about the importance of protecting middle ice. And middle ice is the area between the face-off dots and the rink and I've highlighted that with the yellow uh, lines connecting the dots. So this area uh, is important to defend and we're going to show you what can happen when a puck carrier comes down against four defenders and he's able to uh, beat the uh, defenders by taking the puck uh, through middle ice directly to the net and there's some fundamental uh, mistakes made and we're going to go over them here. So let's take a look at what happens. You see the puck carrier coming down uh, th and he's going to want to take this puck uh, the shortest uh, distance to the net which is between the face-off dots. The last thing he wants to do is uh, take it wide and use speed. It's, it's a lot harder to beat a player wide with speed to the net. Uh, so you see what happens. We've got one player here approaching an angling situation and the defenseman strong side is going to play one-on-one -on -one against number 88 for the Bruins. Uh, the fundamental, there's some fundamental mistakes here and let's talk about them. The first one is the stick being uh, fully outreached with all uh, his weight over his toes, uh, his the right arm is bent. It, I'm sorry, it's straight, not bent. So he has no ability to sweep or poke check effectively, and all his weight weight is on his toes, and he's looking at the puck. He's not looking at the the puck carrier's chest. The player coming across the weak side defenseman to angle. Um, reaches and stops skating. See the reach come out and he's got a bad angle of approach and he tries to play the puck with his stick and he gets beat and a smart forward once he's inside your stick length is going to push the puck through you or by you and pick the puck up on the other side of you and you see how the defenseman's eyes are straight down on the puck he has no interest in playing the body and uh, he goes between the dots and takes the puck directly in on the net and almost scores. Uh, there's some poor fundamentals executed here. Now we're going to take a look at it uh, up close in another uh, video. In this clip, um, it's the same clip I showed earlier, but uh, a little closer up, so you get a chance to see uh, what Pasternak does with the puck and the mistakes made by the uh, weak side defenseman coming across to angle and the uh, defenseman strong side. You see all, you see the, the, the outstretched arm and he's got no ability to effectively sweep or poke check with a, a bent elbow. All his weight's on his toes. Uh, he's beat at this point and uh, he has no ability to move to his left or his right. And his eyes are focused on the puck and you're going to see uh, <laughs> he knows he's beat uh, and the fellow angling reaches and you can tell he he's in an ineffective position to uh, play body stick puck because of his poor approach angle and playing the, the puck instead of the body first and you see the focus by the defenseman with his eyes on the puck he even tries to kick the puck with his right skate and Pasternak pushes it to go by him and there's no attempt to play the body and that's what happens when your, your focus isn't on great technique and fundamentals.